In this demonstration, I'll walk through the capabilities of Oracle's Integrated Lights Out Manager infrastructure, which is available on all Oracle hardware components. As an example, I'll access the ILOM tools on a Sun Server compute node included in an Exologic machine. Let's start the ILOM browser user interface. Use the dedicated ILOM IP address or host name that's assigned to your compute node during this Exologic RAC's initial installation. You can quickly determine if there are any hardware problems on the device using the Open Problems page. From the ILOM summary page, you can view the device's model, part number, and serial number. You can also power the whole unit on or off, turn on its locator light, and even update the device's firmware and BIOS. ILOM lets you view the specifications and health of each individual hardware component, including the CPUs, RAM, disks, fans, and power supplies. Select a hardware subsystem to get more detailed information. For example, you can view the specifications and part numbers for each RAM module. Next, let's view the current power consumption of this compute node. Similarly, you can view the minimum, average, and maximum power usage for the past 24 hours or for the past two weeks. Now I'll use the same address to access the ILOM command line interface. The different ILOM subsystems, or targets, are organized as a hierarchy which can be navigated just like a file system using the CD command and even by using tab completion. However, instead of the LS command, use the show command.
As we saw earlier, ILAM gives you the ability to remotely power on and off the host device. To see all of the available power options, use the Power Control page found under Host Management. As an example, let's simply cycle the compute node's power off and then back on. The operating system will not be gracefully shut down. Notice that I'm able to continue using ILOM even though the operating system has not yet completed its startup. Finally, let's browse the ILOM log to see a history of all the hardware events on this device including the recent power cycle. 